So I saw the list of the Academy Award nominees, and there's been a big controversy, which is, hey, surprise, surprise, it's mostly white people. A lot of people are really outraged about this. And uh, all I can say is they're surprised. Most of the Academy Award voters are like old white people. Let me bring up the statistics on my phone. 94% white, 76% men, and they're an average of 63 years old. It sounds pretty accurate. I did a video a couple years ago where they didn't nominate Selma for anything and that was a very well-made film. It was made by a director named Ava DeVenray or something like that. I can't, I don't know how to say her name, but I know the other work that she's done and it's been uh, fantastic. And they didn't nominate that movie for anything. I thought David Oyelowo was absolutely phenomenal as Dr. King. We have to remember that this has been an ongoing thing with the Academy. We still haven't seen an Oscar go to a black director. I really thought that Steve McQueen, not not the actor, you know, who's now passed away for a while, a very long time now. Steve McQueen, the director, should have really won for 12 Years a Slave, but he lost to Alfonso Cuaron for Gravity, which was basically a movie just showing off its camera work for the sh sake of showing off its camera work with a very shallow story. We didn't see our first black actor win an Oscar until Haiti McDaniel won for Gone with the Wind and then Sidney Poitier won for The Defiant once. You know, and then it went to James Earl Jones. Come on, what's the name of the other dude? Come on, he's always like in those movies about racing trains. <laughs> <laughs> Denzel Washington for Training Day. But uh, overall, it's like black actors, black directors, people who are, okay, not only black, but, you know, we'll say Latino, although they've been getting a lot more love now recently with the director Oscar, thank God. I mean, you got Guillermo del Toro, you got Alfonso Cuaron, you got Alejandro González, Senorito. But, you know, I mean, mostly, what do you have? People who are of any like race outside of white okay let's just make it that way they have not gotten a lot of recognition and is getting a little ridiculous i would say in terms of jada pickett smith's statement and in terms of spike lee's statement saying we should boycott the oscars i'm not sure that's entirely the right direction to go because is that really going to change anything what you really need to do is kind of Get new Academy of voters. Because look, the Academy is filled with these guys who've been in the industry for a really long time. And you know, since it's been such a long time ago, it's kind of like having that old grandparent who has run a company for a really long time and they don't want to give it to their grandchild. They still have like their son in charge who's also like part of that company. And they kind of have like these backwards beliefs. Although Hollywood mostly is known to be liberal, you know, we had to change the type of voters that we have. We can't just have a bunch of old white dudes doing it. Even if it's a bunch of old white women, I don't think that would matter either because we have a lot of racist grandmas as well. <laughs> and racist hands. We need to reevaluate who's gonna be looking over our films because there's a lot of amazing directors out there, amazing actors, uh, production designers, sound designers, sound engineers, people who do shorts and everything else that get overlooked. Also, if you guys really want equality and something that is truly reflective of how an award show should reflect a work that is worthy of the whole year, don't watch an award show. I love the Oscars. It's fun to watch. The Oscars are a thing where it basically is just um, you're quantifying a small number of films that are great compared to a large number of films that are even greater. And I think the Oscars is not exactly the way to go if you wanna really look at what makes an amazing film for the year. You really have to look elsewhere and really kind of dig your feet deep to, to find a great film. The Oscars are pretty much just a big show. Meant for standard audiences to get behind and root for their favorite movies to win for whatever films, few films they choose. We do need to do something about the Academy. We do need to find some new folks to, to vote on these things because if you're just gonna arm twist like all these old white guys and tell them no you're gonna vote for this guy in this movie because all you're doing is picking only white people and you're gonna do this. They're not gonna do that. They don't they don't care. Their minds are made up. At the end of the day you know it's good to get outraged about it but 
it's also good to know that we should maybe, you know, maybe have a petition for new Oscar voters rather than a petition to boycott the Oscars. <laughs> Thank you.